Hello everyone. Today I'm going to tell you how I made this planter stand out of these empty cartons. I took 5 different sized cartons and placed them according to the shape I wanted. Before placing them, I separated their flaps by cutting with the help of paper cutter like this in the video I'm doing that. Now I took 2 to 3 newspapers and cut or tear them into small pieces. I used homemade glue uh, we call it lehi in Hindi that is made of arrowroot powder or corn starch or we call it uh, corn flour in India uh, and water. I took 2 tablespoon of arrowroot and mixed into 3 tablespoon of water mix it well until it becomes smooth then add almost 1 and 1/2 cup of water and keep it on medium flame on the gas stir it well until it becomes a smooth paste I would like to tell you uh, if you don't have arrowroot you can use maida instead of it and uh, if you are not able to find arrowroot in the market you can uh, use a corn flour powder that is easily available in the confectionery stores i place these boxes according to my design spread the adhesive on the top of the box and place the other box over it to make the joints more stronger i pasted them with the help of the small cuttings of newspaper applied the lehi on the cuttings and covered all the joints by sticking them together to give the most strength to this stand i placed a face flap of the box and placed in front of this part and stick them together I divided the uppermost box into two parts by placing another waste flap in the center part of it. Again, applied adhesive to stick them together strongly and covered it up with newspaper cuttings. After joining all these joints, all these boxes together, I covered all the boxes with newspaper cuttings. Here you can see 
in the image how I cover it up with the newspaper cuttings. Keep it for a day to dry it up completely and then cut brown paper in this into the small cuttings just like uh, we did with the newspaper and covered the and pasted all over the all over the box just like before we did it with the newspaper you can see in the image how i did that take a small piece of paper and dip it into the adhesive to make it soft and crush it and press it and then try to make a long strip of paper and keep it aside dip another piece of paper to make it soft and crush it and try to give a shape of leaf by pressing with the help of fingers Now make a tiny bud of the soft and crushed paper. Try to roll the long strip around the tiny ball and give a flower like shape and keep it aside for drying. Now you can see How I made this flower you may call it rose actually I tried to make a rose but I'm not sure about it I'm making another leaf so one flower needs two leaves If you want to dry it up quickly, you can use hair dryer. Finally, I am pasting these leaves along with these flowers on the corners of the stand and will leave it for some time to dry it up completely. Now I will apply white enamel paint as a primer all over this all over the stand. When it will dry, I will give a second coat of white acrylic color. Color the flowers with white and red color and and the leaves with yellow and sap green color. Here I took some leaves from rose plant. I chose rose leaves uh, and, and it depends on you. You can take any uh, you can take any leaf, color the leaves with yellow and sap green and stamp it on the box surface to make a leaf pattern on it. It depends on you uh, where you want leaf pattern. I did it on side walls. When it dries it up completely, give a final coat of varnish to make it waterproof and again dry it up for a day before placing the planters over it. One more thing I would like to tell you that before placing planters, try to keep it over a wooden plank which we call 
पटरा इन हिंदी और यू कैन टेक अ प्लास्टिक स्टूल दैट वी यूज इन आर बाथरूम इंस्टेड ऑफ वुडन पटरा टू अवॉइड अननेसेसरी कॉन्टैक्ट ऑफ वाटर टू द स्टैंड hope you all like my video so please don't forget to like and comment and subscribe the channel or if you have any doubt related to this diy so please 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 comment below in the comment section i will try to get back to you as soon as possible thank you so much goodbye bye bye